Thanks, man. 732 445 9300. 732 445 9300. Give us a call. Good fellow radio show 90.3. Definitely in the building. Justin D. Lab, what up? Woo! Um, our main event, indeed. <laughs> Rashawn Jones is in the building. Woo! What up, Rashawn? How's everything? Uh, everything is good. How about you? Uh, Philadelphia native, but I bet you didn't know this, Q. Via <laughs> Alaska. <laughs> no, that was a... <laughs> Mom and pops from Alaska. Uh, 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 unlike Mr. Obama, oh, he's part of the other state that's not attached. So mm -hmm. he's like... He's like, who, 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 who are you? People from Alaska? Like Trajan Langdon when he played oh, uh, yes. college. Oh, <laughs> yes. Carlos Boozer. You don't really believe me, right? Uh, we absolutely we believe you. Uh, yeah, man, it was written on your bio. You yeah. also say you're related to Yao Ming, <laughs> and you once cooked General T. Saw on a toaster oven. No, I got removed, though, from the family. Oh. So uh -huh. y'all got rid of you because you definitely got the height. <laughs> I mean... I pigment, see a little resemblance. The, the nice. pigmentation a little different. Eyes are definitely around the same. No, you see the eyes? Same. Yeah, they got that. Yeah, yeah. That, uh, they got the same eyes. <laughs> it's a whole different ball game. The high guys just left. <laughs> so, you you had some interesting influences and highlight moments. Yeah. And and, and um, he asked you, yeah, like like <laughs> you know, um, tell him about that. <laughs> no, because um, a good friend of the show, is to jump off Joe Button actually heard one of your mixtapes, correct? The Low I Fall, yeah. Yeah, and that and you considered that to be one of your, your highlight moments. Yeah, that was right? random. I was trying to get the dude that short told me about it because he texted him and I was like, yo, can you like screenshot it so I know it's real? Like, <laughs> screenshot before Drake even made the real. song. But, like, yeah, he did that. How did how did it even get into to his uh, possession and how did you get the feedback? This guy I know knows him. Like, he's good friends with him. He's, he, does, he does a radio show too. I forgot the name. It's cool. Yeah, don't go. Yeah, we don't need that. It's no, good for the radio we, show. We, we don't need that, but yeah. That's that stuff we don't like. It's he cool. did He did that, and um, he did, had told me about it. Because he said that um, I kind of reminded him of him, so he could see what he was saying. Now, that's the reason why I bring it up, because it seems like because of your music, your content, mm -hmm. um, how deep you tend to go into it, people do draw that comparison. And and you you don't kind of, you don't like the, the emo rap attack, though, right? I mean, it's true, but it's not true. I mean, I got stuff. I got like a, a different kind of a lot of music, but like I just choose to put that out because it's more. It's like what I like more. Like I can do anything, but I save that for like random stuff. Like on the like on the Bosky mixtape, I kind of like try different beats I normally want rap on. This is kind of like make people shut up. Like on the complex thing, they said that they said uh, he's too emo or something like that. Now you say complex thing. Elaborate. What the, uh, complex the, thing? Uh, top ten fully rappers to look out for. The okay. complex thing. They made that list. He think, he's all mine. Well, you went you went from top ten Philly rappers to just top ten rappers to look out for. Period. And, Who and, me? In a lot of people's eyes. Uh, yeah, who you. Said that? yeah, yeah, you. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Who said that? A few publications and a few blog friends of mine that like to post your stuff. So I mean. I, I, it seems like this is the first you're hearing of this news. So. Never, and you know what? I've never heard that. How do you feel about it? I don't even know. I, I don't even know I'll how it's rapping. <laughs> what he said. I believe it. I, I like. I would go with it because I, you know, shout out to uh, Mr. Jones here, the homie. Sent me some stuff. I looked at it and I was like, I was actually at work. I was in the office. I just started bumping the mixtape and I was like, yo, this is pretty dope. Like, linked up and he's here acting all humble and. Go learn a lesson or two from me and Kanye. Well, that's listen, Rashawn, if you don't want to rap, that's fine, because I love to. So you can take my part-time <laughs> job lessons, as, a, so. as a radio show host, okay. and, I, and I'll be more than happy to take your fans. All right. I, we can work that out. We can talk off. All right, there we have, then we're going to have to work out something with the height, because I don't okay. think anybody's going to believe it once it, I hit the stage. Yeah. It's all right. It, it is, it is you know Mr. Scholl's got those little, ins, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, now well, I'm going to need 30 Mr. Scholl's. <laughs> <Mrs. laughs> Dr. Scholl's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Dr. All right, so. But, um, and, and is, is it also true once upon a time you, you quit your job to go to South by Southwest? Yeah, okay? like a couple Yo, of weeks ago. No, Did you get your job back when you came back? Nah, you, when you quit it, you can't. <laughs> <laughs> I know, you could have looked. You could have got one of, you know, my mind wasn't right. What'd you tell them? I, was on I text him. Like my supervisor, he he he. he, he are, we we. You we hold on. Where did you work? Where did where, I want? We need to know where did you work first. The block. No, it's this place called. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, he's like, call my command. <laughs> told him, listen, you don't know what I'm talking about. It's called uh, Sentai. It's like a uniform place. Mm. But like I I I Ben was trying to get out anyway. 
So he we we was cool on that level and I was like, uh he asked him was I coming in today? I was like, nah. So wow. why don't you get fired? You could have got you could have collected. It was nah, it was, they don't <laughs> you don't got a union. So and like they definitely wasn't giving it to us. Oh, oh so that that's why you quit but that's on, on, some, me, on some real, it. on some real serious stuff, like that's a really bold move to make to try to quit your job just to go hard on the music. Why? What? How? How long was it that you had to sit there and really contemplate that decision? <laughs> like a year and a half. Like I, I, I was planning that for like a long time, and like I met like him and like this this guy Johnny and them, and they kind of like just gave me that push, like yo, like it's even you keep doing this as like your full time thing and do music on the weekends, or you just quit it and just you know. Too. Like, like like recently like we was at this Jada Kiss listening party so we coming out of the Atlanta Records office and like the Urban a and stopped and me like happy to meet me and stuff like that wouldn't have happened if I didn't quit my job because I would have been working okay. at that time well, so it was I'll, like stuff like just it, it opens, opens a lot of doors for like stuff that I couldn't do because of my schedule like I couldn't do nothing over there I mean well I mean how are you how are you holding living? yourself down yeah how are you sustaining yourself Wait, I have is money the block? is the block the answer now no I quit no. the block okay I mean, I got P where that stood there, but but I just I have money saved up. You know, I'm surviving. He's got blocks. He's been planning. <laughs> He's got blocks support. Yo, question. Black Union. Um, I got. I, I actually have a couple of coworkers that I work with. They're from Philly. Uh, wh when um that list came out, they were very excited that you were on it because they almost see you as an underdog because you speak for and and from the underdog perspective. Mm -hmm. And um they were very excited about Chill Moody. Yeah. Um, I can't remember other dude's name. Is there anyone else that is very prominent that was on that list or didn't make that list for you? That that those should have been yeah. on it. Um, it's this kid named Young Savage. I don't really listen to him, but like he's like really big and um aside. And um like Young Gliss and Sean Fire. You know, I feel like it should have been like a top twenty. Yeah. Gliss Gliss is dope. Yeah. And, and he's definitely like been in contact with us, so it's, it's interesting. You got a lot of different like you, you have a you have a weird taste in in the people that influence you. I mean, you go from what Adele to Radiohead to. I I, I drink Radiohead. milk with spaghetti. Like. What? <laughs> no, Wait, I used are you being to. serious? Hold on, hold on. I, I don't I, even no, know what's going on. No, there's there's I used to. I used, I used to drink milk with everything. But I think it's a Philly thing though. <laughs> not not the milk and spaghetti, but more, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's more, a spot out here called milk and spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> but more the the fact that you you have very diverse um, ears. As to who you listen to in music, and then it comes out in your own music. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like this week, I've been listening to all Little Dragon and uh, Wow Chief Keith. <laughs> yes, all week. that is the yes. most opposite <laughs> world of ever to be listening to Little Dragon and Little Dragon Super Dope. Yeah, and then listening to that's that ish I don't like. Yeah, just all week, like it's just, since since uh like the middle of Tuesday, just the. That and uh, this is a group called the Two Yards that I just got into. Just th those three old. Where you get your music, man? Where do you, where, know, where do you who's your supplies? Who's your supplier? <laughs> nah, it start, it used, it's like the producers. Like they start sampling stuff, and I start asking them, like, "Yo, where did this come from?" And I it just goes from there. Like I go to Amazon and like go to download the album, and then I look at like the reference and stuff like that. So it's I like a library it. of you, books you actually, for music. Yeah. You work with a lot of different producers and everything also. Yeah. I mean, um, you want to name some of your favorite producers you work with so far and who you plan to work with. Um, I might do something with Woody to produce. I uh, work with Lee Bannon, uh, Delonius Martin. My main producers is like T Talented, Roland Mills, and I want to say Delonius, but like we didn't really establish that yet. So those are like the main ones I work with. Yeah, but they, it, it seemed, you know, it's funny because you... Just, just from like old interviews and things you've done before, you speak a lot about the artistry of what you're doing. Uh -huh. So, with your different choices in pr producers, you have kind of different choices and canvases that you're kind yeah. of doing. Like, there's this guy named with. Danny D too, like from Miami. Like he's like somebody. He's doing a lot of stuff right now. Like he's working with Kendrick Lamar, heard and stuff like that. Can we talk a little bit about? the things that have happened to you just in your own personal life because of that tends to come out so much in the music and why why are you just so easily to delve into that so honestly um a lot of a lot of it comes from like just like i've been like played so many times like by people 
like gas me up even to the smallest things like people who, like heard me whatever like from like even a family member to a girl or, or whatever and like losing people and like seeing people who, like go do like their own issues it just comes out in that way i don't know why it's just so i'm just so open with things like i just feel like if i'm going to say something you guys did come heavily armed with the merchandise of Bosky. Yeah. I can only assume from the hair, the the, the mangled hair, and the, and the and the silhouette that uh, this is the trying to do the, the, right the thing. notable Basquiat, the artist of yeah. the nineties. Mm -hmm. um, Eighties. Eighties. Not, not bad. What year nothing. was it? Nothing. <laughs> right, 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 right. Here you go. It's opposite right. day. It's okay. I know I corrected you. I just didn't feel like I should have corrected. No, you most definitely should have. This is the name of your project, but it's yeah. missing a couple letters. Uh, um, can you give us an explanation for that? Uh, my girlfriend, she she was playing with the title, and she just started calling me Bosky, like playing around, and I was like, I don't want people to tie that name to like what I'm doing, so it makes it it made it better for me to just cut it off. Like even though you know where it's coming from, like it's still it's not his name. It made like it made it easier for me. Like I just ran with it. I re I really like it. Like I'm like I might name my son Bosky. Okay. Seriously, no opposite day. Little <laughs> no opposite. You know what I noticed too? Like Let I'm getting it. I'm though. getting it. He smirks a little when he's being for real. Yeah, yeah. Wow. I got you. I didn't notice that. I got you, you yeah. I'm, you I'm, learned, I learned I'm right here. Really I'm right here with you. I didn't even notice mm -hmm. that. So. <laughs> I know how to tell. Oh, no. The Bosky yeah. Project. Just educate us a little bit more on it. Um, <laughs> for those that have not listened to it, what should they be expecting from it? It's like most of the songs we did on there were like old that I put out and I like re-recorded them. But like a good like eight of them I, I did that were new. Like one week I put out a, like a, like five songs from the, from the other project. It's really like a mixture, like a play of like how he like his paints are like just like a mixture of everything. Yeah, yeah. That's kind of what the whole project is. It's like my own Bosky or whatever. Well, um, now that it seems like Rashawn Jones has arrived in 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 the, uh, in the, I guess the social network blogosphere aspect, we've seen a lot of artists do that. Like uh, a Yellow Wolf recently did that with his project that get, that garnered most of his. Uh, um, attention. We've seen Big Crit do that with, uh, with uh, Crit was here. Like they t they compiled their best work or whatever they felt was still relevant, mm -hmm. put it on a newer project, add a little twist to it. So that's what Bosky is for you. Basically, yeah. Okay. Where, and a lot of people. We, go ahead. Where can we listen? Um, it's kind of like everywhere. Like, <laughs> oh. like just like just Google like Rashawn Jones Bosky. Just go to Rashawn. You can go to GoodfellowMedia.com and also get it. That too. That's where you should go. But you were you were elaborating on the thought though. What, yeah. what were you elaborating on for a second? If you still remember it. What'd you ask me? <laughs> the collection of uh, Alaska. How was it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we we wasn't there that long. It was a fantastic time. <laughs> but um, no, the the project and compiling kind of the old things and then making yeah 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 yeah, yeah 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 yeah. A lot of people was like, yo, this shit is sorry. I just this stuff was like like really like dope and everything. I'm like, yo, like these songs are really old, like. He was like, yeah, but like it just sounds better and everything. I don't get that. Like the stuff that I put less effort into, everybody likes. Like, it, well, I mean, I think it's simple. Um, like, I, I mean, the, the gentleman that I mentioned earlier, um, Yellow Wolf, Big Crit, like they've been on in, in their respective region and area. They've been doing what they've been doing for a very long time. Mm -hmm. And then they compile all the, all, like this body of work, and people want to recognize them for it. Yeah. But it's obviously because a lot of, I mean, I think you could. I mean, most people in this blogosphere would agree that. Whenever somebody becomes notable, whenever they get put to, to be put, become part of a list or anything like that, it's like, oh yeah, I've been known about him. That's my <laughs> guy. What that mixtape? And you're like, wait, but these songs are really old, though. If you really yeah. knew about me, you would know that. Yeah, like, like it's people that really like listen to everything I do, and they notice it. Like, like yo, you put out all these songs, and so that's why I gave them like, like, like two new songs, because I know everybody like heard it, and some people didn't hear it. It was like really for like promotion. Like, I didn't plan to, like, really promote it that much, but everybody liked it, so we're going to, like, push it more now. So now, just so they can get a better understanding, we're going to get into some of the music. Okay. But um, I know you're Googleable. You've made that, you've made that very He clear. is very Googleable. Not like that, though. But what, no, you are, actually. <laughs> what social medias and what website would anyone who's not aware of Rashawn Jones, where can they find all your content at? Uh, RashawnJones.com, Spankwire, Pornhub, and... 
Thanks, Ben. Great job. Um, how you, you put us in great company, Ben. All right, I see. They would love that. J O N E S. All right, I'm officially not asking you anything else. This guy is completely out of control. <laughs> so, but even <laughs> even with that, you're welcome anything? whenever you want. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank but, you. But 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 like for real, no opposite day. You're welcome whenever you want. Okay. Right. I told you. I told you it was opposite day. I, I didn't. I didn't believe you at one point. No, I was that serious. What's up, Biz? Oh no, I didn't. Any so any Twitter, any Facebook, any uh, all that extra stuff. Is that Rashawn D- D- Jones, R Y S H O N G O N E S? And Facebook is the same thing, RashawnJones.com. We'll like you. Bye, you're next. <laughs>